It is Saturday, April 3rd, 2021. Welcome to Vita. Why did I pick the third? I only get one tank per month and I already wasted it. Well, I'd hoped that today's video would be something goofier. Maybe just uh, use up a bunch of short uh, taste test videos that have been filling my phone for who knows how long. Or maybe finally my currywurst tour of Europe or something. But uh, and yesterday after I shot the uh, video, I had two autistic meltdowns in two different Walmarts. I think I've been having autistic meltdowns uh, for quite a while, periodically, and never really knew that's what they were. And, um, it, the effects vary. Basically, our brains ha have more neurons firing than those of a normal person, and uh, I already did the X-Men joke yesterday, didn't I? But basically, sometimes we just get overwhelmed, and uh, it depends on the person. I mean, I think some people might... Uh, ever heard of music? Hmm. Sorry if you have. In my case, it just I get overwhelmed, for, stressed out, everything else, and with all the stupid people, and finally I just, I've had all I can stands. I can't stands no more. Da 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 da, -da. I want to scream. I want to hit things. Sometimes I do one or the other or both, and I want to get out of there, which, uh, well, can't always do that if I am at work. <sighs> Couldn't when I had a job. Yeah, well, let me explain. I was at the one Walmart, and, uh, well, I'd already got a little um, on edge because I turned off the highway to get onto the road, and then I was stopped. I had my blinker on. I was making sure that I wouldn't uh, hit anybody, and then the guy behind me drives around me. You know, how dare I stop where it says stop and make sure I don't get into an accident? And I noticed that he was about this far away from the bumper of the vehicle in front of him then, so, you know... Definitely his uh, fault, I think. Anyway, I go in there and it's crowded, and uh, I later realized, well, it is Good Friday. Wait, is that actually a major shopping holiday? I was hungry. That didn't help either. I'm diabetic, and so you know, I really kind of need to maintain a stable blood sugar level. So if it's too high or too low, it can be bad. It was, and it was rather low, and I'd gotten, I don't know, can of some kind of sugar-free, possibly caffeinated beverage, probably something weird. You know, I kind of like to try out weird flavors. And uh, two egg rolls, which, okay, not the best for me, but as far as the grab-and-go uh, selections that can be eaten while driving, you can do one hand and don't require utensils. That's probably the best for me. It's mostly vegetables, right? And also <laughs> a um, bag of chili cheese bugles. I know, shouldn't have had those. I know. <laughs> there were lines everywhere. And it also looks like they didn't have all their registers open. Uh, they, they could have probably done something about that. I'm extrapolating way too much, but I sometimes think that the lines were lasting longer than they needed to because the cashiers were engaging in small talk. Do you understand small talk makes it take longer for the next person in line? I'm not much for small talk. You probably figured that out. Well, finally, I think, okay, wait a minute. Okay, here are the automatic checkouts, and uh, where, where, okay, that's a line there, and I was about to step in, and then this guy puts, gets there and waits in line. He didn't know I was about to get in line. He, it's not like he jumped in front of me, but it felt like he jumped in front of me. I thought, oh, forget this, and I... Just kind of tossed my items into an end cap and it stormed out. And, and as I was leaving, I, I heard this announcement saying, thank you for shopping at Walmart. And I shouted, I couldn't shop at Walmart. Your lines are too long. Or, or words to that effect, probably with some profanity. So then uh, later that evening, I thought, well, it's late at night here. I'll go to another Walmart. I want those chili cheese uh, bugles. Yeah. <laughs> Real vital thing here. Huh? Well, you know, they have separate... The entrance is divided. One side, you go around and you go in. The other side, you exit. Well, so I'm I'm following the rules. I'm going around the thing. And that's what he comes in from the other side, ducks under. She jumps line in front of me. Okay, then we go in and then she takes off her mask, I guess to adjust it or something. Indoors. You know, she could have adjusted, made sure her mask was adjusted if she hadn't been in such a hurry to get in. And then I just... I pointed at her, I screamed, I stormed out, I saw somebody else with her nose sticking out, I pointed at them and screamed, I, <sighs> I just, I'm, I can't, I, I used to be better at this, but I think I've just, uh, well, the metaphorical spoons, I've borrowed the, too many from the future, I've run out, I've put up with the stupid people, and as a reward, people have gotten stupider. Oh, and then this morning, um, well, I went to Weiss Market here my ta hometown, and it was crowded. Well, I guess Easter Saturday, everybody's getting the stuff that they should have gotten ahead of time. Maybe they do, their children would find the candy if they, I don't know, but a whole bunch of people, many maskless, and many maskless or not, 
taking up the whole aisle. Even when there's not a pandemic, I hate when people do that. I try to hold it in, but finally, at a cart. I don't want to make an absolute blanket statement, but it seems like whenever I don't get a cart, I end up needing one. So, I'm just trying to... The way that store is set up, it's 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 not good if you want people to be stress free. There, it's a bottleneck. You have to go through or around, then just forget the car. So you gotta let it go and hit a table. Okay, here I'll go over there. People that just squeeze past them and the bottled water. I don't care anymore. I got out of there. <sighs> yeah, I'm. Then a friend of mine posted on Facebook about all the people gathering without masks. Uh, super it seems like super spreader events because it's Easter. I uh, posted. I've had, that's on my phone, I've had three autistic meltdowns in the last two days because of these people, and somebody else said, those autistic meltdowns are on you. They didn't cause it. Well, kind of. They didn't deliberately cause it, except maybe the person who ducked under. She knew the rules. Just she, and Actually, some of the other people who refuse to wear masks, do they not understand that um, wearing them causes other people to feel less stressful? So they, they, they're deliberately not wearing them just to own the libs or whatever expression you want to use. So I think they did cause, but okay, let's, let's be fair there. Although then later on, he also posted something like, You watch too much news. Do you even personally know anybody who died of COVID? So I'm implying that it's uh, either exaggerated by the media or a hoax. So, still, he, he did have somewhat of a point. I could do more to avoid this. I've one thing, just um, avoid going out unless I, well, I want to say unless I absolutely have to, but need a subjective. So unless I can rationalize it sufficiently. And also try to pick time. Well, I guess I did pick a time when there would be less of a crowd, but if this morning when I went to Weiss Market, the parking lot was pretty full. I could have noticed, okay, that's full, so it's probably gonna be full indoors. Abort. I didn't even really need to get anything in there. And also some some places of business, including Walmart, do make some accommodations. Some places have curbside, which, okay, admittedly isn't very good for um, when you're not sure what you want. You just wanna go looking and hope you'll find something, especially something that might make an interesting taste test video. But also, they have an app. I mean, I've used the app to find things, but I can also use the app the same way as the Sheets app. I can ring stuff up and pay for it in the store. I can avoid the um, cash your lines altogether. So I think I will be doing that in the future um, next time I'm at a Walmart, which uh, won't be anytime soon, I think. Today's task, uh, change the sheets on my bed. and Maybe rotate the mattress, too. We'll see. Wow, I'm really taking advantage of the fact that I can wear blue again, huh?